What is up, everybody? Welcome back to another Moment episode. We're taking a break from the Utah series. I'm back in Texas, but there's more Utah videos coming. Uh, Sunday will be the last one, I believe, and it is an epic, epic video. So stay tuned for Sunday's video. But tonight, we are back in Texas. It feels amazing. It is 65 degrees right now in Texas. It almost feels like I'm back in Utah. But I'm at my buddy Trey's house. He lives on the river. They just got this house done. They just moved in a few weeks ago. So we're down here. I got the thermal. And uh, we're going to see if we can't get a raccoon. Haven't done a raccoon catch, clean, and cook in a long time. And he's never tasted a raccoon. He's like, hey, let's eat some raccoon and uh, see what it tastes like. And so I just pulled up. Let's go in here and we're gonna go thermal the river and uh, most of the time there's raccoons eating on the river so let's go back there and check it out see if we can find one He's 91 yards. Let me see. All right, you ready? Smoked. Let's go get him. Alright, where was this guy at? Oh yeah. Okay. All right, we got him. <laughs> got him. There he is. I'm gonna grab him, pull him out of here. I can't hold a, a light and a camera, so give me one second. And that is what you call a dome shot. He took two, but a uh, pretty little coon. They have not got their winter fur yet. That is for sure. But there's a lot more stuff down on this river, so let's see what else we can get into. All right, guys. Well, as you can see, I still haven't even taken my luggage from Utah out of my truck. But we have dinner. Trey has never eaten raccoon before. Nah. Beware of dogs. Might not ever eat raccoon. You're going to eat it tonight. I might. So I'm going to show you all how to clean a raccoon. He's a little tore up. So I'm just gonna show a little bit. We're gonna take a back leg off. And so he has some orange chicken sauce. Maybe we'll try up a new recipe, but show you how to clean it real quick. Can't show everything. If you watch my last few videos, YouTube's cracking down. So I'm gonna show you a little bit and I'll see you guys in the kitchen and we'll do uh, catch, clean, and cook on a raccoon. So I always do this when they're hanging up, but we can do it this way too. I'm just getting it basically to where I can pull that skin down like that. And then I'll come in and cut this back leg off. Find that joint. Just like that. I'm going to take this this joint out some good POP action right now. so we're left with a beautiful slab of raccoon thigh let's take this guy inside cook it up I'm telling you I'm telling you you're gonna like it dude raccoon is good are you telling the camera or are you telling me I'm telling you I'm telling the camera too if y'all got if you guys I mean it's I'm I promise it's good let's go inside cook it up and do a taste test all right guys, so got the meat. 
I'm going to cut all this white stuff off. Um, so this is just like sinew and fat. They're not, they don't have a whole lot of fat right now. Um, they'll have a lot more in the winter, but I'm just breaking down the different muscles. And this isn't fat that you'd want to rent her out, right? Mm -hmm. I wouldn't think so. I've never done it, but I'm just taking these muscle groups off and I'll cut those up into chunks. And that's what's going in. So I think this is the best piece right here. So I'm just gonna cut these up into little pieces and then Trey is gonna do some cooking too. He's got an onion over here and uh, I don't know what he's doing with that, but I'm just cutting these up in little pieces and then we'll see what he has in mind for this recipe. Yeah. All right, flannel. What are you doing? Totally not cutting an onion the right way. Yeah? Oh, I've seen that trick before. A little slice, 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 and then slice down the other side. And I can see. Some butter. Onions going in. Hear that sizzle. Wait a Oh my God. Now we're gonna take some critter glitter. We're gonna dust off the raccoon. Yep, just like that. Now uh, I'd add it. Add that raccoon meat and uh, let them Grab cook it. together and fall in love. Yep, that's totally. Uh... So we're just letting her uh, slow cook or make sure it's all thoroughly cooked, just like you would any other rodent. But uh, and you're gonna make some white rice. So we got some white rice and we're gonna. So we'll have a bed of white rice and lay some coon and onions over the top of that. So we got a bed of rice, onions, and raccoon going on top. Oh, that's something you'd get at a restaurant. It yeah, it looks amazing. Yeah, I'm like, totally. Taste test time. It looks delicious. Alright, let me just... Oh, okay. I didn't know you were going in for it that quick, but what do you think? Chewy? Tastes like pork. Pork? I'm getting like a porky vibe. Is it good? Yeah, it's good. Okay, well I need a fork because I want some rice with mine. No, like I legit mean like it tastes like... It tastes like something, it's like almost like, it does taste like something I'd get with rice. Very porky taste to it. Okay, well I'm gonna go in, I'm gonna go in, get some onion, rice, and raccoon. Oh. If I can get some unseasoned rice. Unseasoned rice. You gotta taste the rice of the raccoon. The flavor of the raccoon. Chewy. Was your piece chewy? It's not as chewy as most new new meat I've ever had. Like if you gave it a day. I like it fried better. Well, I'll give it like a six six two. It's not Tory. It's not game. No, it's not gamey at all. It's not, like, it's not animal gamey. Oh. Yeah. I mean, if anything, deer tastes more gamey. No, it really does taste like it's like the number twelve uh, yeah, like chopsticks. I, that's what I'm saying. Like it tastes like no, 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 cat, no talking bad on it. Yeah. Like I gave it a six too. What do you give it? I give it like a seven. Seven? Yeah, I that's feel, pretty good. It's. I, I mean, if it wasn't late at night and this is like, hey, this is dinner, <laughs> I'd eat it. Give it like a six. Good job. Yeah. I mean, honestly, it's not it, bad. You give it like a day or something, eight, let it get like a little bit more tender, or maybe, maybe cook it, like you said, fry it. Like, yeah. Yeah, fry it. I think fried is better for sure. That's something I could get used but to. But I like rice and onions too, so. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's it's a good meal. It's a good meal with rice. Yeah. It is a good meal with rice. Pretty good. I get it. Not gonna lie. Yeah, it's not bad. Well, hope you guys enjoy this episode. Remember, stay tuned for Sunday. It's going to be an epic video. But we got what we came here to do. You tried raccoon. Camera's about to die. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit the thumbs up, and remember, eat good.